Hey, Chris Simpson here from Bodies by Design Personal Training. So when is the best time to weigh in? Well, I can tell you a personal story, and this is how not to weigh in. Back in my obsessive and compulsive bodybuilding days, I was weighing in three times a day, all on three different scales, and I was a very confused bodybuilder by the end of my dieting. So we give our clients the same advice. It's gonna be the same day, the same clothes, the same time, the same place. Everything's gotta be the same, for consistent weights because you see there's two big factors that control your weight and that's water in and out and food in and out so first off let's get a weigh-in today okay 194.8 a little on the heavy side today okay now time for our experiment water boy 500 milliliters of water let me ask you a question how much do you think my weight is going to change after drinking 500 milliliters of water. Let's find out. One ninety-five point six. Wow. So one pound, one pound in under one minute. That's how much my weight changed. Case in point here, we're just trying to show you how much water can affect your weight over the course of a day. So let's talk now about water out. A sauna. How many pounds of water do you think you can lose if you sat in here with a garbage bag on? In fact, I usually make a sarcastic comment when clients ask me, Chris, I need to lose a few pounds. Well, I say, well, do you have a few hours? Because I got a garbage bag, I got a sauna, and I guarantee you can lose about five pounds of water in five hours. So there you have it, your grip tip. When to weigh in, same time, same place, with the same clothes on, and remember that water in and out will make a difference on the scale. So until the next time, get a grip on your scale.